Hey, welcome back. Today's Swiss Army Knife will be the Swiss Champ by Victor Knox. Stay tuned and we'll get into it. The Swiss Champ was introduced in 1985 and it replaced the seven layer Champion C as the top of the line. Now this is not Victor Knox's largest knife, but this is 91 millimeter and it's eight layers wide. So with the width, it comes out to about an inch and a quarter and we're right at about that one inch in height. So this tool has gone through several tool evolutions throughout the time to include some notable features such as the addition of the pin which is normally contained right here and the back layer hook in 1991. The magnifier magnifying glass changed to the clear surround and five power in 2004. The metal saw grind changed to the stainless steel variety in 2005. And then it's been available with several different options for scales to include obviously the red or black. I've seen some of them with green, but they've also had translucent scales, hardwood scales, stag scales, and then a few notable varieties or variations, if you will, such as the Swiss Champ Super Timer, which has an analog clock on the scale, the Tiffany & Company stainless, or excuse me, sterling silver that has a gold inlay, and then there's a 100 year anniversary commemorating the 1897 to 1997 anniversary of the Swiss officer's knife. So with this knife, we're gonna call this a 1988 to 1991 knife and we'll get into it. So on the back layer here, you have your four turn fluted corkscrew, which we know is a pre-1991 feature. Then we also notice that we have a precision screwdriver. This came about originally in 1983, but there was a tool head change in 2000, 2003 time frame. So this is the older, older type. In 1985, we saw the introduction of a chisel and this has remained basically the same since 1985. 1985, the precision screwdriver on the back layer changed to this type. And then also in 1985, our reamer all changed from the 1961 variety to include the sewing knife that we see on post-1985 knives. Our opening layer we have the standard can opener with precision screwdriver, but no Swiss pat because of the date of the knife. We have the cap lifter with the post 1985 90 degree stop. As the wire bender has the hologram screwdriver, but we see that we do not have the wire stripper because it was dropped in 1980. 1973, we saw the addition of the inline Phillips. This is the older style. The newer style is a little bit shorter. And I am not sure when they started putting the 90 degree stop. I don't know if that was an 85 edition as well, or if it has always had the 90 degree stop. In 73, we saw the five power, excuse me, eight power gray surround magnifying glass. remain the same until 2004. In 1986, we saw the addition of the pliers. The original pliers were 2.5 millimeters wide. These are the middle variety in a three millimeter width, but they don't have the wire crimpers. So this is where I'm getting my 1988 date is from the pliers. Next layer is the pre-1991 scissors. Include the screw, 
and a double spring. But we don't yet have the spring guiding groove. Have our fish scaler and hook dislodger. Now, in 1973, they did add the scale in both inch and metric on there. And this is a single bevel, as we see. But around the 1985 time frame, we also lost the magnetic tip. We have our file here of the 19 post-1975 to 1980 variety, or excuse me, post-1975 to 1990 variety. The grind changed a little bit in 90, and then in 2005, we went to the stainless steel grind. Have the standard main blade. And I forgot to look up the Tang stamp on this one. We have Victorinox, come on, Victorinox Switzerland Stainless Rossbury. Then we have the Officer Suisse on the back, bow and arrow, and the plus sign looks like it's a little bit closer to the bow and arrow. So I'll try to put a picture in up here of what that Tang stamp indicates as far as the date. Have the post 73 spear point blade. Then for scale tools, have the toothpick. And with the Swiss champ, we get plus scales. So we also have a pen. And we have our standard tweezers. So there we have it, a 1988 to approximately 1991 Swiss Champ 8 layer. If you're enjoying these videos, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I appreciate your time. Stay tuned and be nice to one another.